I'm Regan and I want to show you how you can do examination using P class. So first we need to log in. So you enter your email and your password. Upon successful login, please go to the examination section. You will be listed with all the available examinations. In case you do not see an examination about a certain module, then probably you do not use this module. So to do that, go to my modules. Then choose your modules and ensure that all the modules that you offer are actually checked and then save changes. So once you do that, then you should be able to find that examination here. And if you do not find it again, then please contact me. So we go to details. You will now be presented with the examination instruction screen. Please read all the instructions carefully. You also encourage to check your eligibility for this exam ahead of the exam time to avoid inconveniences. So to do that, we go to check eligibility. Then you enter your exam permit, your exam permit number. And then say check eligibility. And if you're okay and clear to attend this exam, then you receive a message like this one. So we can now start the examination. So just to start the examination, we enter our examination permit number. Start examination. We shall now be presented with a question paper and two buttons. You can view the examination, the question paper, the examination question paper online, or you can use the download button. And you can choose to download either the question paper or the answer sheet, or you can choose to download both. The examination question paper could look something like this. Please read all the instructions carefully before you attempt this exam. The answer sheet will also look like this. Please fill out all the required information in this answer sheet. And also, uh, create a blank page where you can submit, where you can type all your answers. Once you're done, once you're done with your, with your examination and you're sure you've, you've done answering all the questions, please then come to the submit answer sheet. You will then choose this file on your computer and ensure it please that you choose the right file. You will also be required to check this checkbox that you accept that you've not done any plagiarism. Then you can now submit. Upon successful submission, you will be taken back to the available examinations and this will now be disabled and already submitted. And that is how we can do examinations with B-Class.